Hello, my name is Justin. This past year, I went from attempting suicide due to strong depressive episodes to revitalizing myself and my purpose. To be honest, uh, I liked being around people, you know. I liked cracking jokes, you know, just being around good vibes and just being a good vibe myself. But you know the duality of being a joker outside, being this happy person that is always laughing, there's always cracking jokes, there's always a good vibes energy outside. But when you come inside, you know, in the night, you cry yourself to sleep every night. You cannot sleep, you have insomnia. That was me. And at the time, I didn't really have anybody to talk to. I remember I used to call my brother. <laughs> my brother had to talk about it, but that nigga was depressed himself. <laughs> So two of us would just like sit down, we would we'll just be on the phone, be battering ourselves about our depression. I guess he was handling his own differently, I was handling mine differently. It was a very funny time. It's funny now, but it was not funny then. You know, you, you typically don't have anybody to speak to because like your parents, if you call your parents and say, the typical African parent, and say, Daddy, I'm depressed. <laughs> Gaslighting will come in one way or the other. <laughs> Tell you pray to God. Sorry, bro. Like, they, it's, like what? What can they do? <laughs> I'm gonna lie. Like, I felt like I had come to the end of it. I think this happened like in 2021. You know, I always used to suffer from anxiety and um, strong bouts of depression. I wasn't clinically diagnosed to be depressed. But I, I I had strong episodes of depression and I did not get, I did not also identify as a depressed person. I just used to see that I just used to have episodes where this flurry of negative thoughts just take complete control of me, <laughs> you know, consecutively for very long periods. I'm not even going to lie, I actually tried to kill myself because I cannot swim. Right, and I went to um, the Koiling Bridge, <laughs> and I was looking at the water. I decided I wanted to end it that day. I can never, I can never forget that day, November twentieth, two thousand and twenty-one. It cannot, that date cannot leave me because you know, I went to the bridge. I cannot swim. If I jumped, I was literally. If I just literally moved two steps, yeah, <laughs> I was done. <laughs> I would have been done. You understand you know uh, it was a saturday i can still remember i can remember that day like you know i can never forget that day i think i will get a tattoo of that day because that day was the day something changed and something in my head changed because i decided to start living on that day because i had come to the end of it like i was fed up like i was fed up of everything i was like this is not worth living like this is not what i want you know i'm something in me said there's a way out you understand there's a way out you just have to give yourself a chance and i was standing there looking at the water it was death i was staring death right in his face you understand and something just told me this is not the end (laughs) <laughs> you understand and thank you guys for watching this video like comment subscribe to the channel thanks and god bless